What is going on, ladies and gentlemen? We're going to talk about some good news, some good news, and good news. Robin Hood, Vassal Hard Fork, they announced I was wrong. But anyway, let's talk about it. Let's get into it. Let's get it. So let's get into it. Let's talk about it. Robinhood has added Ada Cardano to its ecosystem in its exchange, bringing in the retail investor to our wonderful environment, right? And by doing that, they also give us the opportunity to try and educate some new people about Cardano, what it's about, what it does, what it can evolve into, and how it can be more beneficial to the everyday person. I also want to take this time before I even go into that any further is to wish everyone a wonderful Labor Day weekend. I hope your Labor Day is great and enjoyful with your family, friends, or whoever have you, whatever you're going to do with it. Just enjoy it, right? You got the three-day weekend, some of you four, maybe even five take vacation now. Whatever's working, I wish the best to you. But anyway, let's get back into the video. Let's talk about it. Let's get it. So exciting times, exciting times. We have Cardano listed on one of the major retail exchanges in the U.S., Robinhood. So Robinhood is one of the major exchanges for in the U.S. because it brings in retail investors into a simple, easy environment and how to learn and or availability to buy assets, right? And that's what crypto is. It's not currency. You know my stance on that. You watch my video. It's an asset. There is no such thing as cryptocurrency at this time unless you live in Ecuador, which we don't. So the U.S. considers crypto as an asset, property, and that's all. So as of earlier today, Cardano hit 46 cents again, but it depreciated in value once again because crypto's crypto. We're in a bear market right now. So things are not going to go up. Things are going to go down. These are opportunities to buy, 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 not financial advice. Just letting you know my opinion it is what worked for me the last couple of uh, situations. I'm not going to say more than that. Between the last Bitcoin happening, it worked out really well for me. I'm not going to talk about what I gained or what I didn't gain, but... I kept the faith and things worked out, I'm watching the ecosystem, understanding what's going on, doing my research and being true to what I believe, what the truth was showing me to believe. Not as I felt, because if I would have done what I felt, I would have lost tremendously, like so many others. So many others got scared and they lost their shirts, they sold and they, and they hurt themselves. And then later on, Bitcoin went up to 69,000, right from 20 grand. So if they would have held true, they would have made at least double, right? They sold at 40, 45 they would have been well ahead of the game. It just takes time and patience. This is a new ecosystem. But anyway, Robinhood introduces to us a whole new level of uh, retail investors and investors period to bring it to Cardano for all of us to maximize our potential. And by doing that, we have no need for a burn mechanism because now we're in a major retail environment, a major player in the game of assets and asset management. The next two major exchanges, it was possible that we get on is going to be Webull and PayPal. If we can get there, that's a major, major step milestone. And I have no worries that one day we eventually will get there because of what Cardano brings as an asset class into the ecosystem of trading and retail investors and institutional investment. It brings such a security that we have nothing to worry about. So this is great news. Cardano's on Robinhood, Robinhood's major exchange and I'm just happy about it. I'm really happy about it. I'm, I'm joyful about it. I hope you are too. But let's get into some other issues. Right now, I was wrong about the Cardano uh, hard fork being September 8th. Charles announced the date. And it appears that Vassal will come September 22nd. The hard fork will be implemented by then. This gives exchanges enough time, the app developers more time to get their stuff together, which they probably needed. But I think they should have had it together already. Uh, it is a major improvement. It does need a little bit more tweaking so i get why they went to the 22nd giving them another three weeks to get things done and by giving them three weeks they give them more time to prepare get everything in order and make this ecosystem better for me and you the average person who's using this every day right and now all these other d apps will be available as well uh aada will be launched i believe around a, the week before right september 13th or september 14th it's coming Right, the app deployment on Cardano in a major way is coming. And we don't need a burn mechanism because we have a limited supply. 
unlike Ethereum, and that's the only example I'm going to use. So a lot more ADA will get locked up over a period of time, especially when DJ is, is released. This is about to explode 2024, 25, get ready. You might retire, not giving financial advice, just saying. So I want to take a look at pool PM and we can see right now that congestion is at 93%, 93% right now, then 87% under the five day vassal uh, protocol, but we're not hard folks. So I don't understand why pool PM is putting that. It should wait until we get to the actual vassal era, but it doesn't make a difference. Load is, is pretty high. Congestion is pretty high. After Vassal, we're going to do another follow-up video and see how this goes. So this is my last Vassal uh, video. Maybe not. But anyway, it looks pretty good. 22nd is going to be the hard fork. And I also want to show this on DeFi Llama. We're showing that 81 million, right? It's about 160 million ADA. Uh, a little over 160 million ADA is now locked. And once Vassal comes out, let's see how this changes around October 22nd, 21st after 30 days, I can almost guarantee to be dull, all right? Double the amount of ADA will be locked in and that's huge. I know nowhere near the billions of ADA and, and, and unlike some other YouTubers, we should have hit $10 already because, you know, almost 2 billion ADA was somehow injected by that Cardano Foundation IOG, which makes no sense, but it is what it is. So I'm making this video just for us to give memories and go back to pre vassal 81 million total value locked. Cardano is now 45 cents. It was 44 cents pre Robin Hood. Let's see what happens in the very near future. Your guess is as good as mine, but I have a more positive approach. So I'm going to end the video here. Thank you very much for watching. If you want to support the channel, please subscribe. If you like the content, hit the, please hit that like button. If you want to get notified every time I make a video, please hit the bell notification. You'll get notified every time you make a video and you'll watch it again to the end. I'm trying to make these videos a little bit more enjoyable. I appreciate you. Blackstar. Light in the darkness. Peace.